Hey, yo, YouTube. So today we'll be showing how to give your friends modded cars and stuff like that. So you want to make sure that your friends in a different, like a different um targeting mode. Like you, he's in free aim and you're in assisted aim. And you want to go go ahead and join him in invite only. So he wants to start up an invite only with while being in free aim or yeah free aim. And you want to be in auto aim, assisted aim. And then also you want to get close to the circle. This is you giving the car to the other dude. This is helping glitch you out so he can get the car. So you just want to get right here, wait for him to come over there. You want to have one person. You need three people for this. You need one person sending a tight number job for the whole little glitch. And then you need that a person that you're giving the car to and then you. So make sure you have somebody sending a tight number job. And then you want it to join them through the friends list and then you want to accept first decline second and you should come back out right here and you want to double tap the playstation button again or hurry up and go back to her rubber join on xbox again and then you want to wait till he says you're dead whenever he kills you you have to join hurry up and press join and then as you join it should show you so now I want to accept first decline second after I join my, the friend that's in a tight number job that's in a different targeting mode than you. And then he kills you, decline that, and then spam X after you get in the circle. Spam X, spam X, spam X, spam X, all the way until you come out, and then you should see that your your map is glitched out. Then you wanna get in a car, or like just run over there to the side, which I really prefer just getting in the car with your friend. He should be driving, and then he wants to turn off his headlights, and make sure his headlights are off, he wants to go as if he's parking that car into the back of his MOC. Pull up there. Right on the he hits right on the D-pad. Whenever the tail lights come on, you get out the car, you get back in the car, and then he needs to back up to the parking garage. And then press on parking garage, hurry up, press the PlayStation button or the Xbox button, and then hurry up and get back on GTA. And then on your screen he should be disappeared, but on his screen he's not. It should be forty five seconds of that and then as of that, you wanna, whenever he reappears, you wanna get out the car. The car should go as if it's going into the parking garage. He wants, and you wanna blow yourself up somewhere away from the MLC in the car. And then as he's in the infamous black screen, you wanna start up a tight number job. And then after he, you start up a tight number job, you want to make sure that he joins you after you get in there. And then he lets you know whenever his screen is like going down and zooming into the map. And then you hurry up and leave a tight number job. So as his map is zooming in, you want to leave. It, your partner wants to leave a tight number job. So I'll get to you guys. All right. So right here, we we'll go. As he does that, he should get in the infamous black screen. I blow myself up. I start up a tight number job after I respawn. It should give you, it, it don't matter if it gives you the first error or not. Sometimes it don't, sometimes it does. But this is basically, that just glitched him out to where, no, that just glitched you out to where you're gonna be invisible soon. Tighten up a job. And then he wants to join. And then as he join it, he'll let you know as soon as his map starts zooming in and then you want to leave a tight number job. He's not going to leave a tight number job because his map started zooming in to the map. Alright, now you want to turn away from the casino parking lot. Same with your partner. And you want to wait for him to request his MOC. And I'll get back with you guys at this and once he gets here. So after his MLC arrives, you want to run over there and you want to lean up against the back of it and t like you're taking cover and hold at your interaction menu. 
I do it a little late, but you wanna do it as soon as you get back there. And then while he clears out the cars to where he can basically pull the car into there where he can see the blue circle. And then whenever he sees the blue circle, he wants to run over there and he wants to enter alone. After he enters alone, it should appear him back outside, invisible. And then he should run to your car and then he should get in your car and then turn out his head and then he can just pull it out. And then you guys will see that. And then I'll, got, I'll show you guys the perspective of, the perspective of me receiving a car from him. Alright, so now that as he's getting glitched out, he needs to join your friend that's in a tight number job in a different target mode through the friends list. And then after he does that, accept first the clone second. And then whenever he's ready, he double taps and hovers over join. And then you let him know whenever you kill him and he hurries up and join. He should respond back right there and walk into the circle. And then as soon as he walks into the circle, start, he wants to spam X. Get in your car that you want to get rid of, but really just any type of car, get in it, he gets in it with you, make sure your headlights are off whenever you guys take it to the MOC, and then, so your headlights is off, I'm making sure right now I'm finna do it, they're off, and then I pull up, I hit right on the D-pad, Whenever the tail lights come on, he hops out the car, get back in the car, and you just want to back up to the parking garage, press on parking garage, tap your PlayStation button, and then hurry up and get back into GTA or Xbox button. You just go to the home screen or whatever system you're on, and then hurry up and get back into GTA. And then you're still there. This is you. You shouldn't be able to move your camera or anything, but he shouldn't see you. You should be invisible on his screen. This is basically turning you invisible for whenever you get in the back of the MLC. So wait 45 seconds until he you reappear on his screen and then whenever he'll get out the car and you'll be in an infamous black screen while he starts up while he blows up himself and starts up a tight number job. I'll be back with y'all. Alright, so now I'm gonna reappear. He gets out the car. It should do this right here for you. He should go blow up himself and then hurry up and start up, start up a tight enough job. He lets you know whenever he gets in there. And then wait until he gets in there and then join him. And then you should just wait. And then whenever your uh, screen is zooming back into the map, you wanna tell him to hurry up and leave a tight enough job. And both of you guys should spawn out here and then you call back in your MOC and then he leans up against the back of it uh, holds up in his interaction with me while you go in uh, enter alone and then you should be invisible outside you should get in his car and then it should teleport you inside your MOC with his car and it should dupe it right there so right now I'm just waiting for him to get in the type of tighten up a job I'll let you guys know whenever you need to tell him to leave the leave the uh, tighten up a job So I joined them through the party, accept both of those, and I leave a tight number job right there. And then you want to hurry up and hop out the car before he starts up the car. And you want to just wait until you stop falling, you appear on the top, on the ground. And you want to turn around and request your MOC. And you want to wait for it to get there. Now that it's here, 
we both run over there and we go to it you clear out where you can see the blue dot to where basically you can store a car in there and then you want him to lean up see he's giving me that car right there that I pressure and then you want to make sure he leans up against the backup and with his interaction menu open so as we're going to clear it out alright so we clear it out he goes lean up against the back of it holds open his interaction menu you can park the car wherever you just gotta get to the car he just pulled it up just to be pulling it up he, he's holding open his interaction menu while he's leaned up against it you run over there enter alone and you should come out invisible enter alone he should appear right back out there invisible except for the clown second on that get on it and then it's yours and then there you go that's how you do for, dupe your, that's how you get friends a car and hope you guys like the video let me know how it is if I need to go through it with you guys just let me know and I'm out